Hello everybody and welcome to another Game Pass Game Pressures video. Today we're going to look at Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbocharged. Now I did play this at a friend's house so I'm going to have, uh, I think it's, I think, I don't know, I can't remember. I had a text about it, I think I did three, three races? I, I didn't play that long. So I, I'm going to be a little bit into it. I think it was three, it could have been a four, I can't remember. Okay, so I tried to look to shut the music off, but uh, it apparently doesn't have it. So, um, but they're pretty cool about it. They let us use it. So, um, I need golf course beat the boss. Uh, there is free DLC with this. So, we found it. Quick, Darla, activate the shrinker trough. Wow, it works! We'll see how it works on living things instead of toy creatures. We're not just living things. We're your friends. Your big friends. Now my tiny friends. It, it works. works! Quick, let's jump into a car and finish this thing once and for all. All right. Now you can upgrade your cars to kind of make it where you, you got an easier chance. The only bad thing I have against this, and I will be honest, is with some of these, like, they make it where you can't be affected by the obstacle courses, which is cool and all. But it just breaks the immersion of you having to do it. Do some things. Okay, we're we'll try from here. Okay. The other thing, guys, before we start this, is having the uh, X and B. be the um like this little tiny shift you can do you can knock people aside which is cool but sometimes it doesn't work as expected uh, the other thing is is the jump is why listen I know Bethesda has made it a natural thing and natural ability to make it where the Y is the jump button but here's the here's the fact of it is that with some of your jumps you have to hit the boost when you hit the boost it, and you let go of boost guess what happens your car stops boosting unlike the first one where you can just press A and go and boost this one does not so when you're in the middle of you need a long jump you need to speed up your car you gotta let go of A real quick and press the Y button. Or, like I do and try to attempt to, hold the A button with your left. You ready? With your left. Now hold the A button with your thumb, with your right thumb. All right? I don't know why I said left. Anyway, when you hold the A button with your, uh, with your thumb, you then bring up your, yeah, you guessed it, your right pointing finger and magically put that up onto the Y button. Try it for yourself and see how uncomfortable that feels while you're using the middle finger to hold down the trigger. Yeah, very uncomfortable. And I got long fingers and this is even uncomfortable for me. So let's get into it. That's my only uh, complaints. Uh, we're gonna see if we can shut that off. There is. Yo! With your, um. Your game? Please. 
make it where we can shut the music um off this is master and audio okay I, okay this i guess music i guess we're shutting the music down and we missed okay okay where are we starting then I missed it. That was, that was perfect. Okay, he's trying to hurt me, so... This is one of the free cards you get, by the way. As you see, it makes you your life a little bit more easier, even though I don't like the design of the card. we go there's all our stuff there's our challenges okay so yeah so all right I played this is five I think I'm looking at right now yeah there's five to the first area including the boss. yes okay including the boss okay so that was, that was my fifth race So then I'm gonna show you guys the um what you can do, what you get. Um they took high inspiration. It had eight legs. And zero chances of beating us. Technically, they're tentacles, not legs. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, anyway, ignore me. <clears throat> so you can do this. You can do this race. You can go to quick modes. You can do. You can go to your garage, your track building, building your tracks. So there's some downloadable content if you want to download. Of course, there's multiplayer. 
But we're gonna look into what makes this game actually kind of a little bit better than the first one. I do like the challenges. The challenges are absolutely fun. Bam. As you see, the specialist challenges, the superstar training, there's the collector, there's the fan. All I gotta do is use a common. Okay. And one more race. Because that doesn't count as a race. One more race will get me that in this. So yeah, uh, that's that's something that's pretty cool. You can go to customize. Of course, everyone knows what this is. You just basically go over here. You change your background. I don't really mess my background much. Oh, apparently we got something else new. We got a new tag. Yeah, I'm going to stick with my fearless. I'm waiting for a better one, yet I haven't got one. So, when you go to your garage... You can see collections, you can see shop. Shop is where you go to buy the actual cars that you want to um, grab. Um, collection is what you have. But every once in a while, when you level up, you can get spins. This is where you go to do your spins. You can also get your sticker editor, you can also, and then library editor as well. So these two you can uh, design. Not only will you be able to upload it to um, the um, library selection or the sticker selection like from the community, you can also put yours up and people will go and download your stuff that you make, which is pretty, I'm not going to lie, it's pretty damn, damn cool. They, they're taking high inspiration from Forza because Forza does that. And now then when Forza did it, uh, Need for Speed also started doing it. So now you got all these little, these car games, racing games, actually innovating and putting these into their game because who wouldn't like to download free stuff? But yeah, um, so that's that's basically it. Um, I don't want to make this a too long video because I, I got I'm already tired and exhausted, and I'm ready to call it. But I have few more videos to make and I've been up all night if you haven't know if you don't know uh, I'm making all these videos at once to give you guys uh, multiple videos to watch during the week <laughs> and this is the only time I get to do it so I stayed up all night last night but <laughs> yeah so that's basically the game um, really, really fun game. Highly recommend it. But I do not. I recommend you guys switching. Um, which is what I'm going to do. Because I forgot that's actually what I was getting irritated. I pressed the wrong button. I highly recommend looking for this. And moving it to something that is not going to screw up. So, does the right stick do anything? I don't think so. So yeah, I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna make this. There we go. And that should be easy. Now now when I'm steering and using the right stick, I can click down on the right stick. That'll be a lot more easier. Because holy hell, doing that shit with the right button. But yeah, you know what? 
But yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna end it here. Thank you guys for uh, watching. So, I sorry I didn't make the video longer, and I've been like bullshitting. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend changing your the jump. And uh, let me guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Let me know how you guys feel about this one compared to the first one, because there's a there's a lot of um differences and like people's opinions and I, I just love to hear people's opinions on games me i'm kind of i kind of like this game a little bit better when it comes to like the challenges but i like the first unleashed the prop was unleashed uh, better when it comes to the collection of cards the style of the game the style of the map um, the, how easy it was to um, do things and how challenging you know, some of these things are that you had to skip some um, events to do to get uh, yourself something that would be able to allow you to do that event this one is just straightforward it's just like yeah follow this linear path I, I kind of I mean it's just cool but at the same time it kind of Shows that they drew back on the campaign side in order to give us more things you can do with the car, which is not a bad thing, but yeah. Until next time, be kind to one another. I know I'm rambling on, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.